my doctor sat me down and uttered those three words you never want to hear. I, you have cancer. I think that when you're young, cancer isn't really something that's on people's radars. There's no road map when you get diagnosed. I wish someone could have sat me down and said, this is what you need to do, this is what you need to learn about. But when I first got diagnosed, I was still trying uh, to understand what my doctors were saying. Uh, the medical jargon was just so over my head. I started noticing changes in my body. I was having hot flashes uh, and all sorts of other symptoms that I didn't quite understand. And the concept of menopause had never crossed my mind, obviously. Uh, I was 24 years old. I started to think something was wrong with me. Maybe it was in my head, maybe I was dealing with some, emo I just didn't understand what was happening. Um, and my doctors never broached the topic of menopause with me, which is a very common side effect. I think that sex is a taboo subject for patients in general. Uh, you're sort of stripped of your sexuality when you get diagnosed. People tend to forget that you have a life outside of your life as a patient. I didn't know if it was appropriate to talk about sexual health with my oncology team, but I think that especially when you're a young adult and you're still discovering your sexuality, you're still coming into being your own self and, and feeling confident, um, that conversation is incredibly important to have. Uh, sex is an important part of our lives, whether we're 20 or 30 or 50. The thing that was most shocking to me was how if you don't know or understand what's happening, in your body, you can blame yourself or you can blame your partner. I think that even if a doctor feels that sexual health is outside of their area of expertise, they at least need to provide the patients with the resources or with a reference to someone who does. Just understanding um, that the symptoms that I was having um, were a result of my chemotherapy and weren't psychosomatic in any way has just helped tremendously. I think that I was psyching myself out by thinking that there was something wrong with me and not realizing that it's a very normal side effect. What I used to think of as lifestyle issues, now I realize that sexual health is much more than a lifestyle issue. It's a medical issue, it's a health issue, it's a wellness issue. Feeling like I can talk about it has lifted a weight off of my shoulders. If there were one thing I could say uh, to another patient or to my younger self is that you're not alone and that this is very, very normal.